Greetings everyone. Manupatra brings to you the news highlights of 24th January 2023. Starting with the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court has dismissed an application seeking to vacate an earlier order of the court that stayed the restoration of a criminal case against former Karnataka Chief Minister B.S. Yediyurappa and former State Industries Minister Murugesh Nirani in an alleged illegal land denotification case. News highlights from the High Courts Starting with the Delhi High Court The Delhi High Court, while observing that COVID-19 vaccination cannot be insisted upon by the employer, has granted relief to a government school lecturer seeking permission to teach and undertake other responsibilities without being forced to take the vaccine. The High Court has sought union government's response on a plea moved by journalist Tanul Thakur against blocking of his website Dowdy Calculator, a satire on India's Dowdy system. The High Court has directed the Delhi government to issue a circular directing that the identity of a minor girl who is seeking medical termination of her pregnancy and her family shall not be disclosed in the report prepared by registered medical practitioners to the police. The High Court has refused to quash a money laundering case against the Quinn's founder Raghav Bell at this stage. The court at this stage also refused to quash the lookout circular against him. News highlights from other High Courts The Bombay High Court has asked the police not to arrest celebrity Rakhi Sawant till Tuesday in a case filed by another model. According to the prosecution, Rakhi Sawant showed some videos of the complainant which are sexually explicit in nature to the media. The Kerala High Court has observed that owners of the vehicles are also liable to be prosecuted under Section 113 sub clause 3 of the Motor Vehicles Act 1988 in case they have permitted the vehicle to be driven with excess weight. This concludes the news for today. Thank you so much.